All right, so we're gonna go right from SR Mullen's changed server to another changed server on Roblox, because I have found another one and I wanted to check it out. I don't know how recently this last got updated, but it's still, I'm, I'm curious about it. So this is one that's done by Wolfgirl541. Uh, it seems to have some custom models, or at least they're played as custom models there. Wolfgirl and Amber Cat there, you see over there. That's kind of interesting, being some basic uh, faceless white latex and such. Let's go ahead and check this out, see if it's any good. Oh yeah, feel free to join off of me, guys. Anybody, any, when I'm doing Roblox stuff, that is that is always an open invitation to just go ahead and join up with me if, if there's room on the server and such. So if you if you guys in the stream want to ever join up on something that I'm doing Roblox-wise, go right ahead. You don't have to ask permission, unless I otherwise specify. All right, so what do we got here? Okay, a bunch of bottles, of course. Can't be a change RP server unless it provides you a bunch of bottles. That's, that's an important thing. What is this? <laughs> I'm sorry. Is that from Change Special? Because I, I still haven't played Change Special. I'm waiting for the final version. But if that's for Change Special, that's great. Um, all right. It's a, it's a puppet. Um, face and hat remover. What we got here? Credit of the art. Drake and Snow on Twitter. <clears throat> oh, this is some of Drake. Yeah, I've seen this, actually. Yeah, I've seen this art, actually. He's, I guess this just got put up by them. because Dragon Snow, by the way, does do other TF art and stuff just casually on his Twitter. Um, as well as on his FA, but his Twitter is more active. I gotta say, I love a transformation where, like, like this, kind of, like, structured like this, kind of hanging the limbs with the chest and some of the legs exposed like that. That's kind of neat. It's kind of a neat way of doing it. The stream might be a bit delayed for me or something. I don't know. Oh. Dragonstone likes his bulges, it seems. Well, you know, it's... I'm actually kind of impressed this is still on Roblox, actually, but technically there's nothing wrong with that. It's just... It's it's a, it's a detailless... It's a detailless pocket. It's fine. Um, hold on a minute, though. And the server is now being swarmed. Yeah. Uh, let's check something. I'm a little concerned because somebody mentioned stream delay. So let me just check something here. Um... We're gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna one, two, three along with the oofs, all right? Let's see if this is synced or not. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, one, two, one, two, three. Oof sync. I oof synced. Oh, I didn't really check the volume levels on the last, uh, well, the volume wasn't that important in the first place, but how loud was the volume when, when we were playing the previous server? It's actually a good question to ask, especially considering there was that copyrighted music. But if it was pretty quiet, then it probably isn't a big deal. And here we go. Here again with some chain special stuff I'm not going to pay much attention to. What is that up there? I know the morphs look out of place, trust me. They work once you actually get into them. Fair enough. I'm not paying attention to it too much, though, because I kind of want to keep myself from being too spoiled to uh, the special content. Um, well, this, is a, this is a really old... Actually, if I recall, this is a really old picture from Dragon Snow. And by old, I mean, like, this was made before, this was made before, um, he a actually worked on change whatsoever. This is, like, one of the first designs of a mass transfer thing that he did, actually, I think. So that's kind of interesting. Um. You're in the way. <laughs> <laughs> this is also an older one, I think. Actually, I don't know if I've seen this one. Gosh. He always says... I really do love his style. It's gonna be so much. It's just, it's such a simple style. You wanna, you wanna make Dragon Snow style art. It's very simple. It's binary tool. So like an MS Paint, like the basic pencil tool, or if you're using another program that's more fancy, the binary tool. Select size three or any variation of three, any any uh, integer of three. So basically size three, six, nine, twelve, depending on the size of what you're working on. Um, and that's your lines. That's your line size. Work with that, and then flat color in. Maybe add a little bit of sh shade, shady shine if you want to be fancy. It's actually pretty simple, but it's a very effective style. What? Oh. Ooh. Hold on a minute. Six, 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 six. Wrong. Oh. There's a puzzle. I did not expect there to be a puzzle, but there is a puzzle. Hmm. Okay, I'm going to keep that in mind. Five digit number. Okay. 
Does anybody know the solution? I assume not. 11037. Why does it sound familiar? Hmm. Try 420 and 420. No, fuck you. <laughs> it took me a second to realize what you were talking about. I was like, no. Alright, well, we gotta look out for a code, I guess. I guess I should be something. Hold on. If anyone figures out the code, let me know. We're, we're gonna try to solve it. There's a bit of the roof here patch, patched out of it. Pitched, pitched out of it. I'm gonna be... Oh yeah, another thing, by the way. You know how Colin wasn't that expressive? I say another thing. For those of you on YouTube, you really should watch the new uh, video on Esther Mullen's server before watching this one, because that's the like, chronological order. Go watch it! It's in the playlist that you're probably in right now. Um, but I'm just gonna follow up something I was saying from that video. Uh, something about, something about, oh, hello, uh, something about, um, uh, Lucas, the main character of Shifted, he's gonna have a little bit more going on than Colin. Colin was, Colin's thing, I completely understand the way Dragonstone made Colin. Colin was, you know, he has kind of a straight face, he did react a little bit in fear now and then, but, and he reacted in anger when, if you got that one bad ending, but, in truth, um, Colin was kind of a blank slate of a character because he was designed to be the player. Lucas isn't exactly designed to be the player. You know, it's not supposed to be a proxy character. You can still technically make Lewis, L Lewis, Lucas a, pro a proxy of yourself while you're playing if you want to. But he actually will have proper dialogue. He will probably have more... We're, I intend him to have more emotion in his sprites and such as well. Um, so that, that's a thing. You know, and both, both, both have their own... Both, both forms of... These, <laughs> I look like I'm just in a costume. <laughs> All right, let me remove my head. Um, face remover. Goodbye, face. Goodbye, hat remover. Uh, but yeah, so Lucas should be a pretty interesting character, though. I don't think he'll be. I still don't think he'll be like super duper fucking chatty or anything. It's just okay. I see where we're at. He will be able to speak for himself and more motive. Lucas ain't Mr. Whitebread then he got flavor. Well he's still white, I guess, but I think uh Colin's Colin's like nationality isn't really Huh. It's Colin, I just sorry, just unexpected music. Uh Colin's nationality was never really explained, but I I can just say out, right off the bat that Lucas and this isn't really a spoiler because if you if you look at his name structure it's L U K A S it's actually, you can pick up from this, he's Russian, actually. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> Probably Russian-American, as in born in America, but Russian. What was that song we were listening to? I don't actually recognize that one. Definitely wasn't from Changed. Oh, like me. Yeah, like you. That's right, you are, aren't you? Forgot. I always forget about that. Wait a minute, what's this? That looks like a secret button, if I ever saw one. Doesn't seem to do anything, though. I, I mean, I'm actually looking for secrets, because we have a code to find. <laughs> So, as a group, let's try to find it. Actually, I'm, I'm kind of curious. Uh, just ask this question as we check around. Oh, they also blanked the pictures because they had to. I'm surprised, though. Okay, so they had to blank the pictures, and yet they were able to get that one transfer in the, in the first room. Apparently past Roblox uh, security. <laughs> But uh, one thing I'm kind of curious about, I've, I've asked this question before, I think at some point, but I'm kind of curious what people want. Like, what 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 animals are they are, are people excited to possibly see in uh, Shifted? This wall's too high, I can't see over it. St stand still, one of you. St there we go. Oh, no, you're too tall. It doesn't work. It doesn't work at all. 
Eh, whatever. I want to look at it. You made people happy? The only Italian guy here that likes furries. You No? No Asian... Well, okay, maybe actually here? Yeah, probably. I was gonna say, I have an Italian friend, Sparky the Chew. He's, he's a furry. Um, he's also Italian. <laughs> I'm interested in something cra bizarre or crazy like a water bear. Ooh, a water bear! That's an interesting, that's an interesting, uh... Example. I definitely want to be creative, but at the same time I have no problems picking, like, classics as well. I don't mind picking some animals that changed it as well. Um... You know, Change had a kitty cat, you know, the, one of the first areas, the, the the little feral kitty cat. I would like a little feral puppy dog. Also, you'd be in Shifted, because of course I would, I mean... That wasn't really done. There, there was a there was a photograph transformation involving a puppo and a scientist, but that was not actually in-game. That was just a photo. You have to have moths. I'm planning moths, actually. I've got a whole mechanic planned around moths. A whole mechanic planned around dealing with moth polynites by messing with lights. It's a puzzle. It's a it's a perfect puzzle. It's a light puzzle. Kind of setting. I, I, the way I'm going to do it is like there's multiple lights down these tight hallways where you can't get around the, the moths, so you, and they will get you if you approach their light that they're at. But basically, time switches for light switching. Time light switches where you can basically set up a little circuit of switches so that the lights turn on and off in a certain way that you can get through and the moths move out of your way. It's gonna take some thinking though. <laughs> oh, this coffee cup has coffee in it. Makes it better than all the other coffee cups that are broken or don't have anything. Fun fact, this song has an intro that nobody knows about because they have to buy the soundtrack. Okay, well, those those that buy the soundtrack know, but yeah. Normally the song just kicks right into the normal loop, but there is an intro. I'm sure it's not exactly new news for everybody, but... I'm sure some people didn't know this, so I'm mentioning it. Wait. Oh. Yeah, it would be a memory puzzle. You'd have to see how the light switches affect the different lights and, and how fast they do it, and then set it up so that the lights turn on and off in the order, in the in the speed you want them to, and the rate of the way you want them to. It'll be complex, but not, not... I'm not gonna be stupid about any of the puzzles, like, require you to be a savant. I am, after all, a dog. I don't... I don't like really frustrating puzzles, so I wouldn't really want to design really frustrating puzzles. I want to design puzzles that will require some effort. Remember the path, yeah. Oh, light, oh, light puzzle, memory puzzle? Oh, that's planned too, don't you worry. I know what you're saying. You're, you're saying basically a thing where you like have a room lit up, and you can see a path through it, and then it goes dark, and you can't see the path through it anymore, and you gotta remember it. Yeah, I got something planned for that. Uh, that was actually one of the things I, I brought up a while ago. Uh, there's gonna be a chemical storage section, and it will have uh, it'll have these creatures that it'll have polynites that basically kind of they're not radioactive, but they kind of look it, they glow, and uh, if you at all get within their glow radi if you get in their glow radius whatsoever, they will spot you because you're fucking in their light, and they can see you, and they'll just chase you and grab you, and you're done. But they what they normally do when you're when not aggro to you is they just they patrol a route through this area. And that area has all these, uh, well, they're, they're basically pitch black slimes, so this dark area is this dark area. You can't see them, they're just puddles on the ground that you can't see. The only way you can see them is with the light from the latex you can't get in the light of. So basically you have to wait for the this, or late, not latex, polynite. You have to wait for the polynite to walk through an area, and then walk behind him in the darkness, remembering the path that he just revealed to you, basically. Without actually getting into his light, because if you if you overdo it, then yeah. So it's gonna be a case of you want to stay right behind him, so you can remember the path easily through the slimes or the puddles. But if you 
If you get a little too if you get a little too rowdy about following them, you're gonna run into his light and be in trouble. Uh guys, I just picked up a coin. <laughs> Wait a minute. Okay, do I need to find coins now? What? Maybe that's the key to unlocking the puzzle? That's weird. Um, I guess we should look for these. I've only found one coin. If you guys find others, let me know. I'm gonna start looking around a little harder. <laughs> Intriguing. Oh wow, I'm way faster when I run. I should run more often. Wasn't that in one of the other games? I don't remember. I'm intrigued though. You mean one of the other servers I checked out? I Maybe? Regardless, there's a giant safe in the first area and... Well, maybe the coins serve a purpose towards that, so... Oh, that's a thought. It could be a, it could be one of the codes from changed. I mean, somebody could look up a video and change and try to remember, like find the area where a code was entered and find out what the code was. Was it a five-digit number? It's possible. I think I found it. What'd you find, Luxio? If anybody figure, if anybody in the server with me, uh, by the way, I'm relying on you guys, kind of. If you guys figure out the code, or find some coins, I'm relying on you. Don't let me down. I'm trying to remember where to go for the uh, code. You got the code? <clears throat> All right. Let me finish exploring this area, and we'll go back to the beginning. Oh, um, actually, where the fuck do you go to? Again, I get lost in the vents. I, I, this is a, this. Is, it doesn't matter how many times I go through them, I will get lost. Repeatedly. Am I the only one with a delayed stream? Apparently. I mean, I mean, I asked if the sync was working correctly, and people said yes. No? Wait. Okay. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, one, two, one, two, three. What is... Okay, you guys are synced. Then, yeah, what the hell? So, you, you guys who have delayed streams, would you try refreshing? Delay like time, not sync. Oh, delay like time. I mean, it's possible. Streak a wall on the right north of four with oh. I mean, no, delay is normal with Twitch, guys. Delay is normal. Oh, I see what you're... Yeah, no, 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 guys. Delay is normal with Twitch. Twitch will always have a few seconds. It can be anywhere from 5 to 15 to 20. Um, it's normal. Alright, where do I go to go forward here? Because I'm dumb. Please help. Oh. Oh, what? Secret. Oh. What? <laughs> I'm confused. Why was that just an invisible wall? Okay. 20 seconds delay isn't... I mean, it can be if Twitch is having a shitty day. Because trust me, Twitch does that sometimes. I don't remember it being literally invisible wall though last time. Yep. Oh, it's okay, mystery. I was just trying to figure out if there was an abnormal issue. Oh god, I can barely see in this place. Mm. 
push, 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 push. Okay, guys. <laughs> Just had to crab myself around him, it's fine. Wait, is this the end of it? Oh no, this this path. And then this path. I don't know if there's a coin here, but I don't really want to find out. Because it's so fucking dark. <laughs> it's so dark I could barely see there was paths. <laughs> so. I think it's this way now. Yeah. It's a puzzle unchanged. I forgot that was a puzzle, actually. Fair enough. I found one random coin. That's it so far. Kind of weirded me out, actually. What? Oh, I made it to the... I very quickly made it to the gas area. Um, alright. This is fine, I suppose. I forgot, how so I forgot how short this song is in this in this area. Oh wow, actually. Hold on a minute. Those fans are actually working, I just noticed. That's kinda neat. Water sounds. I would have expected a coin in this can here. If, if you want to hide coins around, that's would be a perfect place for it. You could say you're not a fan. You could say you're a fan. I am a fan of those fans. Any coins here? Nope. Okay. What's if I... Oh, I can't even actually fall in the dark, deep water. I'm not really seeing any other coins, I'll be honest. I'm sorry we're leaving behind, friends. That's really only the vid sections that confuse me, otherwise I'm generally fine. So this is interesting, because I can tell this person definitely bottled all this themselves. This isn't just like a copy-paste job or anything. This is itself all, all very much original. As far as I can tell, anyways. Unless I'm being, unless I'm being tricked or something. I'm just looking for coins now. I'm so confused why there was just a coin. Secret. I'm a secret, go away. <laughs> I'm hiding. <laughs> no one will notice me here. <laughs> I look like I'm just being sneaky. Side glance. <laughs> Colin can even be the Doomslayer when he was young. Both don't talk and they act. Hey, there's a thing, by the way, about, about Colin, and also some misconceptions about Lucas I'll, I'll explain too. Lucas is about 24. Colin, I don't think is a kid either. I believe Dragon Snow's art style simply makes humans look a little small. Because if you look at the other pictures of, of humans in the game, in Changed, all the humans kind of have a young look to them, even the ones that are clearly like researchers and stuff. And I think that's just, it's just kind of, it's kind of a variation of Chibi, if that makes any sense. It's kind of like Chibi, except for more of a... It's kind of an Asian chibi, I guess. I'm, well, actually, chibi started from an Asian perspective. I guess I don't know what the hell I'm talking about, but you know. You know what I'm trying to say. Does this look like another one I played? I don't know. I don't remember the winning... I don't remember the rotating fans and stuff. This might be a copy-paste. I can guarantee you, though, that the starting room was different. I can absolutely guarantee you that... It, I mean, honestly... Oh. You know, there are the, the the number of puzzles are here though too. Cause there was definitely no 
I mean, we could try the number puzzle here, I suppose, for the, 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 for the safe, I suppose. This might be, this could be, Colonist 21 according to, oh, really? I don't know how accurate the wiki is, though. It seems to make up a lot of information that isn't, from what I can tell, substantiated by Dragon Snow, so it could be, it could be just fan, it could really just be fanon. But, 21 seems sensible. Yeah, that puzzle there is four digits, that's why I didn't pay much attention to it, because I'm like, yeah, it's not long enough, though. Oh, there's actually a transparency of these crystals. These the tower the only weapon were those scissors in Dr. Cade room. Uh what? Oh I see. Are you talking about the Doom Slayer thing you're just mentioning? I feel like most of the changes are gonna have the same map is slightly different. That is possible. That is possible what Mystery said. Um I'd like- I, I need to get into that safe, though. That's kind of- I require that safe to be accessed. Yeah, you know what? I kind of remember this, too. Like, th this outside area, specifically. I feel like I have seen this before, but I want- that safe is different, though, as well as the art of the first room. So I'm thinking what probably happened here is that the, the creator of this map probably- or rather, the person who put up this map didn't make this map. What they did was... Take it from the other thing I checked out a long time ago. There was a thing I checked out a long time ago. I think. But... They did add some things. I'm just gonna kill myself. They did add some things, though, because... This whole room was definitely... This, this room is totally customized. I guess, I mean, it's not... It's not that impressive, I suppose, considering all they really did was add on a couple new rooms, but... I mean, they did a good job with this room. They should have just worked this from scratch and been, you know, less copy pasta about this. I wanted this safe, though. We must get in the safe. I wonder. Maybe there's a code just kind of hanging out somewhere around here. I bet all the original content is in the safe. I want to find it. Oh, 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 game lagged there for a bit. All right, we're good. It's supposed to head because I removed my head. Hmm. Just kind of looking around the custom room, wondering. I found the one I found wasn't right. Okay. Thank you for trying, by the way. Did, did somebody try the code from changed? I see somebody has at this point. We stack on two people. Oh, I think I know what you're thinking. All right, come here. Oh yeah, you're thinking of. Okay, I don't know what you want to do, but sure, go ahead. Do you see something? Take a look. Snake is stacked. There we go. Could just be an admin area. But it's kind of weird to have an admin area that with a password. You could normally make an admin area in Roblox by just simply having it coded to have a death wall or just a wall in general that only a certain person or a certain select number of people can go through, and if anybody else tries it or glitches, tries to glitch through it, they'll just die. Um, that would That's normally how I see admins areas being made. Snake, just stay there for... Uh, somebody just stand right here real fast. I want to see something. Let me get on top of the safe for a second. Thank you, that'll do. Mm-hmm. It's either just bad designing or this does something. No? Okay. I saw characters. Hmm. 
You can brute force the 100,000 possibilities. Uh, not want to do that, really. 3D characters? I wonder if it's just the same 3D models that SR Mullen made. I thought they took them. Or if it's different ones. Oh yeah, I can see them too. There's like a frame there. There's uh, it seems like there's custom models in there. Actually, ones I haven't seen before. I could tell. Hold on. I'm gonna do something really creative. I assure you, it isn't worth it. Why is it not worth it? I've been in there, it's not much really. Super secret bottles. Indeed. If I stop at just the right frame. I want to break in. He knows one digit. That would reduce the... How many did... It, how many did gets are there? <laughs> did gets... I mean, now we've reduced the chat. Now, if we know which digit it is, then that reduces the pull from 10,000 or 100,000 to 1,000, I think. If you only have to deal with four for brute forcing. Yeah, we see some, we just see some recolors there. What about on this side? There's some 3D models over there. Big, there's a big boy in there. You can kind of see it if I do this. It's a big boy of hips. There's a thick hip fellow in there. I want it. No. Oh, maximum jump speed. Oh my god. <laughs> my jumping. I'm so excited. Hundred thousand. Oh, it's only ten thousand. <laughs> this is a team that doesn't help that much, actually. <laughs> Near the end of the game, I saw numbers. Oh yeah, what, what are the numbers? Let's try to solve this mystery before we go. We're all we're all kind of intrigued now. I just want to see the secret models. Let's try this actually. Maybe you can tell us where the five is. I think I understand. So there's a button we can use to open the other side. Oh, but how would I even do that? I must, I must access the thick boy. Okay, so it starts... Oh, fuck. Nice. Nice and done. That, wow, that, uh... That's a... This is a much smaller room than I thought. <laughs> so we have a spring, a spring for springiness. Uh, what's this? <gasps> but I got a... I got something, though. I got a key card. Huh. Okay. Okay, that's kind of cute, actually. It's based off of that model, but it's like high definition. Got mom's credit card. The key card works on one door. Which door? Yeah, thick boy, though. I mean, he's not super thick, but thick boy. I am thick boy now. I am. 
I am. What is wrong with me? <laughs> what have I? What have I done? Um. Hold on. Can I like fix this by doing this? No. I have this now. Um. Right then. To the door! That's hot. Thanks. <laughs> Alright. He said Craig, Craig. Fucking. You know, I have trouble typing and streaming. Fuck it. That's good enough. Does that person have a. All the snake with the floating key card. All right. I'm perplexed by this. All right. So where are we going? Hold on. There we go. Oh. Oh. Is this is this what opened the? Okay. All right. Well, this is interesting. All right. Where are we now? I see eggs and only eggs. Eggs. Egg leg. Egg leg. What the hell? <laughs> um. Ha. Huh. Ha. Huh. Ha. Huh. I have idea. Where did everyone go? You should have been following. So it leads to a weird trap. Yeah. Well, it's the sinner's room. You broke. You broke into the safe. You go here now. Curiosity killed the. I don't know if I'm. I don't know if this is killable. I don't really know if this is killable. <laughs> Suck in the abyss. Well, I know my I know my way around an abyss now and then, but you know, uh, I guess we're done here. <laughs> All right. Well, this is a weird sir. This is a weird. This is definitely a weird server. The the wolf boy, or what was her name? Hold on, let's remember. Wolf girl five four one. Wolf girl five four one. As far as I can tell, I just kind of copied the map from another, from another source of some sort. Kind of like the other map I checked out a while back. But yeah, there's differences, and well, there's the safe, and there's this, and I'm confused. But still, an interesting curiosity, all the same. I think I'll get going now, though. <laughs> I guess that was Wolf, Wolf Girl's change map, or her variation of an existing map. Anyways. Mm -hmm.